morning guys what is going on what's popping today is day five of vlogmas <laughs> what's going on so i apologize for my abrupt introduction this morning currently currently i'm hungry that's what i am but no i have arrived at the location where we film my confessionals for back chat um i'm literally just about to do my face because i didn't put any makeup this morning i literally put concealer under my eyes and some contour and that was about it so i'm gonna wipe this off i'm gonna do my makeup properly i'm gonna try and do it as quickly as i can because i'm gonna be filming in a second um i changed my top as well i wanted to do a little bit of shoulder you know a little bit of shoulder today but um, yeah i'm gonna go because i know that um they're gonna come out any minute to come and get me so i gotta try and transform my face and my hair so i'll see you guys in a sec and just say hi <laughs> Say hello. What's up? I'm looking rough. What are doing that? Lovely, jovely. Yeah. Look at him in his sliders, tracksuit, you know. This is behind the scenes, guys. Say hi. No, no, no. Okay, no. well, just, just, ooh, head me no, no, nicely. No. Wow. Why are you pretending? You know you love it. Yeah. And then we have Chris over there. Oh, my God. There's a reason for that. <laughs> Today is your debut. It's your debut. Say hi, Chris. So we're filming right now. Let me let me show you how I look. Yeah, I transformed, guys. I was looking rough and ragged before. You know, got a little bit of dark lip going on here. My hair is much more laid, but my wig is falling backwards. So we need to just. Bring that forward a little bit. Yeah. I think untuck. Well, you're not even gonna see that. You're gonna see this much. But yeah. Hello, guys. I look, I look, I look, I look nice on camera. Does anyone have a necklace? Gold necklace, anybody? I could have done with just a nice choker or a nice little necklace <laughs> or a nice something, but... Confessionals. I know, but and I'll say, look, Tina, wasn't I just saying I don't need to switch? Yeah. That you're going to be in the cold while I'm trying to avoid this. My lips look... No, 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 no. See, look, like, crusty. It's mad, it's mad. That's right. It's not driving. Oh, is it? Am I even correct? Is my mic correct? Yeah, you're Because I ain't doing this again. Because I ain't okay. doing this shit in I ain't doing this again. Y'all be paying too much for this ish, okay? <laughs> I'm told y'all. Can you see? Negative. I just feel like a lot of people feel like they want things like financial freedom. They want to be able to work when they want to work. They want to be their own bosses. And entrepreneurship gives you that opportunity. It gives you the ability to work when you want to work, to work with your own hours, to pay yourself however much you want to pay yourself. Oh, ladies and gents, that is it. Can I show you now, Zoe? Can you just say hello? Hi. <laughs> I like one auntie. My <laughs> and you, you're wearing it like an auntie. Is the fact that you've got it tied like that's how aunties wear it. That's how aunties wear it. Auntie Zoe is over there, one of the the producer, director, everything behind the camera of Backchat. She is there. <coughs> so yeah, guys, we're done now. I'm so tired. I'm literally contemplating getting an Uber, but I really promised myself that I wouldn't because I spend too much money on Uber every single freaking day of my life. But yeah, I'm tired. I'm, it's time for me to go home. I'll let you guys know whether or not I get an Uber. Right now, I'm 80% sure I'm gonna get an Uber. <laughs> guys, this is my tune. Yeah. Shout out to Shantania Beckford, because she put this and I got obsessed. Couple of rubber and then that there. Hey. I'm, I'm gonna party tonight. Who knew feel that I spent some cash? my tune and it's not just because you're here i was by the way adrian's here guys Yo! Say, hey. it's not actually i was i've been wanting to play it for time but i was filming something yeah 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 
mm, 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 mm. I'm still trying to learn the words, so bear with me, yeah. But yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my tune. Ooh, mm, mm, mm. Nah, Shantania. Shout out to you, girl. I was watching your video and you played this, and I love it. I listen to it every morning now. It gets me to work. So I've really got one minute left. Bruh. So I've really got one minute left. I don't know if you guys can really see me. But I'm in back of the Uber. <sighs> yes, guys, I did it. I shouldn't have. What a waste of money. But I'm so tired. Um, and my bags are heavy. And I was wearing like heeled boots. If I was just wearing flats, then fair enough. But I'm wearing heeled boots and I just couldn't bother. So I'm on my way home. I'm tired. It's been a long ass day. So I might actually end the vlog here. I don't know. I might continue it later. Who knows? But if I do, goodbye. And I'll see y'all tomorrow. But if I continue it, then I'll see y'all later. Yeah. Hey guys, what is going on? So I'm just getting ready for work and my wig is shifting because there's a lot in my hair. This wig, by the way, is not even mine. It's my sister's, but I've like stolen it from her for ages and I've been wearing it. And it's just the worst hair ever. Like she just bought some hair off of AliExpress. But it's literally the worst hair ever. It's doing the job for now and it looks okay now. Give it a couple of hours, it's going to be trash. Anyway, I'm running late now for work. But I basically had to get kind of like ready, ready because I'm going to a screening tonight. Or we, I'm going with Ben to a screening um this evening myself wow myself and ben are going to a screening this evening of the film molly's game we're going to like an exclusive screening it's coming out i think in january and um the wonderful people over at vamp uk invited us okay i gotta stop talking and i gotta go because i'm really running late so right guys so i've just left um it's actually not that cold today and i decided to actually dress like I'm going to work today. I've been dressing very casual the last couple of days. Um, obviously, like I said, because where I work, you don't have to dress really small, but yeah, today is another day. Right, hey guys. I know you guys probably cannot see me properly, but I have literally just come out of work. I've changed my shoes. Which I'm kind of regretting. Maybe I should have just done it <laughs> when I got to the station or when I got to my destination. Ooh, that rhyme. But I've changed my shoes into my lace up heels. By the way, they're from Simi. Simi shoes online. Basically, I've changed. I'm now going to the, what do you call it? To the, what does it smell like? Poo. To the screening of. I'm gonna go because there's a lot of people in the park. Because it's dark, it kind of looks a bit mad. So I'm gonna come back to you guys. Why don't you carry the train? 
wow, do you know what he really did? He really went to go and sit on the other side because he wanted the angle to be right on camera scheme. How many is Ugly. Huh? Ugly. Really yes, I am. Scheme. Wow, disgusting. <laughs> Never feel sick. <laughs> Clapped you. This it were late because of him. It's all his fault. All his fault. Me, I did a whole day at work and I could be on time. This guy, what's he been doing? Jobless. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know why? Do you know why? I was listening to a podcast. If I'm jobless, yeah? Yeah. If I'm jobless, you're going to pay for your reward today. Because I'm jobless. Skin, I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. You will never be jobless. I rebuke it. No man of mine is going to be jobless. You'll get left. you get left. Be jobless then. No, I'm joking guys. People will actually think, people will take this seriously and be like, she's only with him because of the money. No guys, I've been there when he's literally been jobless. Wow. You know he says this kind of stuff to me all the time. He's so mean. Wow. Oh, my lips, my lipstick is gone. I need to put my lipstick back on. Basically, we're late because of this guy. Yeah, the this, train is not is even moving. Yeah, yeah. Like, this is sad. I'm very upset right now. You more chewing up? Mm-hmm. Good. I need it, don't I? I know. And he's also been cussing me, saying that I have so many breath. He's so mean. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the ladies on the district line is down. Leave my camera alone. Due to having into the local customer taking on a train. We're still seeing their exit knowledge. Probably took us about 10 15 minutes from St. James's Park. We're going to stop. So, don't have a little bit of 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 a so, maybe Missy like, wanted to say something later. Like, so a bit confused, you see. No, do you know what I'm talking about? I hate this happening. Maybe should we just get off? Missy, yeah. like, yeah, you're lucky, like, oh. The train's been broken down. Yeah, she did. Am I a train mechanic? <laughs> yeah. Am I stopping the signal breaking down? Yeah. Stop when I'm broken. Yeah, I just say it was going to be stopping the boy. Tell that this I need to finish TFL. Maybe for real though. Like, they are the prices up. Fam, they're crazy. It's stupid people. I can't deal with them. 3.4 increase. I know. The highest increase in like, God knows, in how many years. And these people think that's that just, that's just normal, regular people... That's just Nissy regurgitating news she's heard elsewhere. Yeah, apparently everything is fake news. According to this stupid trash. Anyway, listen, listen, listen. Pause. Mm -hmm. Is that according to Mr. Who? Stupid trash. Who's the president of the United States of America? Oh. Do you think I'll say that about you? No, you're a lot of things, but you're dead. I was about to spin her jaw. Wow. Wow. That's actually a good thumbnail. So, guys, this is currently angry at me. She's sulking. Um, she's even gone slightly red. Um, a Western European side of the I'm red because I'm hot. <laughs> it's hot on this freaking train. And we're late and I'm upset and I didn't want to be late. But somebody over here couldn't be The next station is Cannon Street. This is a district line yeah, train to Alminster. Yeah, I'm going to go and see it. What? You see it? You finish soaking up. Soaking. Look at your family. Look at your family. Tell you. Hi guys. Yeah, that's what I'm for. She fears authority. I have no idea what I'm even doing on this table. So we've got someone here distributing some cards over here or something. Oh. 
and I've got chips. Oh, These are called chips, right? Chips. Oh, there we go. I've got something <laughs> right. Chips. These are chips. I'm about to bet. Oh. So we've got Nissi here trying to learn how to play pro car. Yes, sir. Listen, Thomas is hiring. I'm going to pop today. Oh, you're sorry today? I'm going to pop What you say? So Nissi's doing some. Uh, <laughs> Does the Bible tell you to play poker? Mm -hmm. I didn't even hear what you said. What did you say? All right, all right let, let me stop filming now. Do you, do you want to retract that statement? Do you want to retract that statement? No, I retract it. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Mimi trying to get me into trouble. Quickly, quickly, quickly. This is vlog I don't know how you It's my birthday and I'm tired. Right, so we have Ben over here. The lighting's gone a bit funky. But Ben apparently feels like he's a real G out of this game. Oh. Oh. This time I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it to myself. I'm really not. Right now I'm just watching him play this game. Apparently he's good at this game. Oh my lipstick is gone. Don't. Oh my god. I don't know with this. He's really living his best life out here. Supervising this. Right, so um, Ben's gotten a bit excited. He's put everything in there. His wrists are mortgage. And <laughs> <laughs> Said he lost the mortgage time ago. God forbid I rebuke in the name of Jesus. No mortgage of mine will be lost in poker. No way. <laughs> no, no, no. No way. You lost. You risked no. everything. Hey, wow. Look, look. If that was real money, girl. Oh! Listen. Oh. Look at the pictures that we took on our photo. Like ten minutes ago, she was like, "Oh my god, But you see, I, I get a feel. I want to play it. No, no. And someone come on your eye. Whoa! What happened to the lighting? There we go. It just did itself. Hey guys, what's going on? So I'm now at home. I sound so quiet. And I'm really, really tired. I'm literally just about to. Um, I'm literally just about to text Mr. Benedict and let him know that I got home. It's even sound. His journey is much longer than mine, so he's definitely not home yet. But thank you so much um, once again to Vamp UK, who are amazing for um, having myself and Ben at the screening, the exclusive screening, I have to say it's exclusive because it is, but the um, exclusive screening, just kidding, screening of Molly's Game, it was, do you know what, it was such an interesting movie, like, you know, it's definitely not a movie that I would have chosen, like, went out of my way to be like, yeah, we're going to watch this movie, like, it's not something that I would, yeah, go out of my way to watch but it was actually a good movie like it was it was just different it's just not like any movie i have seen i don't think ever or like recently it was yeah it was a really really good movie i'll definitely 
um recommend you guys to go and see it it's just something a little bit different and the storyline is different and it has like a lot of twists not necessarily uh, i don't know how to explain it but basically it's a really good movie um but yeah i'm super shattered right now but i need to edit um these two vlogs because obviously i didn't upload yesterday so i'm gonna put this into a two part so day five and day six mashed together like i said if i can't do every day i'm gonna do you know i'm gonna film every day but put the two days together um me yeah, i'm just really really tired i need to wipe off all my makeup because my face is just looking nice and shiny i need to take off my wig um but yeah guys um also oh my gosh i wanted to apologize for um not uploading a wake up wednesday as you can imagine it's been super super hectic and um it's been really hard for me to try and sit down and film wake up wednesdays and yes i know i should bulk film i'm still working on that i'm gonna bulk film wake up wednesdays um either th either tomorrow night which is thursday night or on friday yeah so i apologize but this wake up wednesday is very very important i okay so i did kind of film it it just didn't look the way that i would have wanted it to look i don't like how it looked therefore i'm gonna do it again um and it's a very important wake up wednesday so it's not gonna come out wednesday it's probably gonna come out either thursday night or friday first thing in the morning um but yeah it's just it's a really important one so i'm gonna so we're gonna make sure that we we do that and also like so something i've been thinking about recently which i thought i'll just share with you guys because yeah obviously I'll just share it with you guys but like i've been feeling like some type of way um about my weight recently obviously if you've been following me since like the beginning of my channel you guys will know that my weight is something that i have pretty much battled with my whole life like i don't remember a time where i wasn't worried about my weight where i wasn't concerned about how i look where i wasn't concerned about this or that like genuinely i do not remember a time in my entire 22 years of living where i wasn't worried obviously when i was baby and stuff but as soon as I had some sort of consciousness about my body and about how I looked, I don't remember a time not not worrying about what I look like. But recently, and this is something that I forgot to mention in my life update, but recently where obviously like I've been working and stuff and it's an office job, so I sit at a desk, I've just been eating a lot. And obviously it's not an excuse. Um, at the end of the day, I still have control over what I put into my mouth, but it's really difficult when you're just sat at a desk and basically you just eat, innit? Like, you know, and then people bring in snacks and stuff, so you just eat, but at first it, it didn't bother me but now it's getting to the point where it's really bugging me like it's, it's actually something that's making me feel uncomfortable and it's making me feel extra self-conscious but it sucks basically i just feel like i have to do something about it and i've been saying for the longest time that i need to um but yeah um basically it's just something that i know that i need to work on um but it's hard is really hard which again i'm not using it as an excuse <sighs> but it's hard isn't it it's hard because um i don't know how to describe it but it's just a crappy feeling like i've just been feeling like not like myself recently i feel really like slow and sluggish and lethargic not in terms of like <sighs> I don't know how to describe it because in terms of myself and like my pace with everything that I'm doing that hasn't slowed down like I'm going quick but in terms of myself like physically like my body I just feel slower I feel lethargic I feel like whatever and it's it's well, obviously you know you put crap into your body you're gonna feel like crap you're gonna look like crap and that's exactly what I've been doing I've just been 
eating whatever I want. I've like not been caring and stuff. And at the time it's all fun and games when you're like, I don't care, eat what you want, do what you want. But then your body responds to that. Like your body is literally a temple and you know, if you're putting constantly putting trash into it, you're gonna feel like that and that's what I feel right now. I just feel like um and um I know that like Gracie hates the word detox. Like I've I've I watch a lot of her stuff, especially because obviously she talks a lot about weight and obviously put confidence and all that kind of stuff. And um, I've learned a lot. And as I've mentioned in previous videos, I'm trying to unlearn a lot of things. But I genuinely do feel like I need like a detox. I feel like sometimes a detox is good. Um, obviously, I'm not a, a nutritionist. I'm not an expert. I'm not. This is me just being honest in it in terms of just my thoughts that are in my head right now and I'm just translating it out. I feel like sometimes a detox is good. Just like sometimes you need a detox from social media. Sometimes you need a detox from just things happening in your life. Hence why people go on holiday because you just need a detox from life. I feel like sometimes you need a detox in terms of just... I just need to stop putting crap into my body. Um, and I need to deal with this head on... And yeah, I need to do something about it basically because I need to exercise, I need to look after myself, I need to watch what I'm putting into my mouth. But most of the time I just feel like, mm, whatever, or I just feel like, oh, I can't help it, might as well, you know. And it's not helping because it's making me feel like crap. Um, and that's how I kind of felt today. For most of today. Um, in fact, I've been feeling like that for like, a hot second you know not like i don't even know i don't know what i'm saying basically basically i'm gonna go now because i don't really know what i'm saying but i feel like i need to go on like some sort of diet or something like i just but then i need an end goal i need like something to focus on i don't know man i don't know basically on a lot of weight and i don't like it anyway this is ending the vlog in a very high note i apologize um i'm good though i hope that you are well i hope that you are staying positive and staying happy and staying amazing and beautiful and on that cue Bay's calling me so i'm gonna in fact let's see if you can hear me hello there sir are you editing ugly? Wow, I was actually filming. Did you hear the way that he, he spoke to me, guys? This is how he speaks to me on a regular basis. What, what are you filming now? I was literally filming my closing, like, of the vlog. I was literally filming my closing, who cares? Listen, guys, I'm here now, listen. Alright, so this is Benny Banks reporting live. I'm at Waterloo Station, about to get the 0009 service calling at... No, call, was it? What did it say? Calling at... Uh, no, no. Hold on, let me start this Void again. Void rubbish. Let me start again. This is Benny Banks reporting live at Water Station. I'm about to board the 0009 train going to Guildford. The train will be calling at Vauxhall, Clapham Junction, Wimbledon and Surbiton. Benedict will be getting off at Surbiton. I look forward to amazing you as your friend. But for now, I will enjoy my uh, two cheeseburgers, my McFlurry... <clears throat> I'm not very crunchy, and I'll also be enjoying my weed and fries. Bye bye. I right, cool. Wow. You're gonna call me back, yeah? I right, cool. Wait, wait, wait. Peace you up. can stay on the phone. I'm done anyway. Peace Peace out, love. Say bye to the vlog, babe. Say bye to the vlog. Bye, everyone. This is vlog. That's number five. Enjoy the thing. Jeez, he even remembered that is number five and six, guys. Get yourself a man that remembers what vlogmas you're up to. <laughs>